the state finals, I know we, right now we feel like we failed. But someday you'll look back on what you accomplished right now and you're going to realize you were you pioneers of Wagner football. You hear me? And uh, there's nothing I'm going to tell you going to make you feel a whole lot better right now because there's no doubt we could have won that football game. Trust me, there's things I've done different. There's things some of you have done different. There's nothing we can do about it now. But be proud that we're Bulldogs. I'm proud of you. We've overcome a lot. We've overcome a lot. I guarantee you when we started the season, if you told the coaches and the fans and probably each other that we'd be playing in the semifinals without Dylan Cantrell and Curly Thomas and Kevin Hawkins and White Probes and Albert Lee Moore were banged up. Guys, no one would have said that. said there's no way. There's no possible way that can happen. So I commend you for what you continue to fight through. Nobody ever made an excuse. No reason to. But, uh, I'm proud of you. Proud to be a bulldog. We trust ourselves out. Yeah, I had every opportunity in the world to win the game. And I think basically in the fourth quarter it came down to who, who screwed up the least. And, and we just couldn't capitalize. You know, for one reason or another, fumbles, fumbled snaps. And, uh, we had some alignment problems where a couple of things we got lined up wrong. And uh, it's just one that got away. You know, it, it really, it'll burn for a while. But that's, uh, that's, that's football and that's life. So we, we deal with it. And um, it doesn't take away from the success that we've had this year and our seniors. And, uh, just proud to be a Wagner Bulldog and to continue to be in situations where we can you know, blow opportunities. So we're, we're here and we're playing. So uh, you do this six out of eight years, we feel great about where our football program is. Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, when you took that lead there, your first lead, you know, you I felt, like we, I felt like we were going to win. I, I really did, and we had them third and forever, and mm -hmm. um, sink, break several tackles, tackles that we should have made, and, you know, they scored, and, and then we uh, we have a, you know, young man not on the extra point team that's supposed to, and they got a penalty there, which gave them the two-point try. So we basically gave them three points, snap over the head, and so now we're behind because of poor plays on our part. So it wasn't, um, you know, I just felt like they gave us the opportunity to win, and we just didn't take advantage of it. Yeah, and, and Everett still has, you know, a typical game for him, something, right? Who's that now? Lawrence. Yeah, he, he ran hard. We just didn't ever get him loose. We got him loose one time there the first play of the game. They called it back, but, uh, you know, he uh, we just had a hard time getting him loose. They, they, uh, they were very good up front. Our defensive linemen were very dominant, and we knew that going in. But I really thought we might get him loose one or two times, and we just, you know, the one time he got there before half. But other than that, we just couldn't do it. Um, talk about the senior class that you have, you know, the success you've had here. They've been a great group. They're the winningest group to ever come through our system, and uh, they can hold their head high. And there's been a lot of football played in Wagner for a long time, and they can say they're on top right now. And I'm sure our juniors want to beat them. So they want to go win more games than they did next year. It's a great group. Thank you so much.